If I had 30 minutes left on this world, the only thing I would do is try to get a level 3 goat, level 3 lobster win to achieve true 100% in super auto pets. Let's jump into it. We are playing on pay to win because we have true completed free to play. Good squad, honestly. Uh, roll me, Skeeto Skeeto, not bad. And jump in too. Call myself the untouched sausages. <laughs> Back to Crass. Crass is in. Crass is in again. Anyway, hope you guys are all doing well. Hope you guys have a have a good day going on for yourselves. I'm vibing here. I have an upcoming trip to the great nation of uh, of the United Kingdom. Gonna head out tomorrow. Figured I'd throw in some super auto pets, do some housekeeping stuff today. Uh, and that's and this is part of that. You are part of my housekeeping errands. AKA trying to get this done. I have about 30 minutes, kind of a packed day today. Definitely would like this. Definitely want the hatching chick. I don't know if I want the ant. Total transparency. I think I don't. I think I do this. And that's good. Anyway, saw the comments in the last video. And every, every motherfucker in the world's got something to say about me using a turtle. Everybody's got some shit to spray. Um, Ludwig, you are obsessed with the turtle. It's better to pill it. I genuinely think that a melon, like a raw melon, is a bad investment. It's just bad. No if ands or buts. Just literally bad megalol. Uh, that is my theory. That's my hypothesis. Why? It's especially worse than pay to win because of all the mosquitoes. All of the bats. It's it's so easy to get a level 2 mosquito. All the hedgehogs. You know? It, it just don't make a lot of sense. We are going to lose this one. What a phenomenal team right there. I, I just got blown up. Holy shit. Give me something good here. Llama's interesting. I kind of like it. Let's make a llama happen. I think I sell... I'm going to keep the fish around. And I'm going to try a little llama build. Because llama works so well with goat. Probably should have put the hatching chick in front of the llama. Would have had an 11-14, but that's alright. I have found that it is always better. Genuinely always better to have one strong unit rather than two balance units. One 40-40 rather than two 20-20s. Uh, I will sell you now. Get you involved. Nothing there for me. Nothing really there for me. I mean, I'll grab an apple. I'll grab one. Would love a goat. I'd probably get rid of this hatching chick for one, or even the the skeeto. Already looking pretty phenomenal. This uh, this this goat, this llama. I'm mixing I'm mixing up animals left and right, brother. All right, I'll do this. That's just a pair, and you get some gold back. That's just a pair, and you get some gold back. Okay, not the best. In fact, close to the worst in terms of draw potential there. Oh, you really needed to hit this guy. We would have won that had you done that one simple task. Uh, but we will instead lose now. Mosquito, you failed me. I don't think I want more of you after you failed me. I don't really see a sense in going mosquito here, to be honest. Hatching chick, maybe? This is kind of crazy, but I'm considering going for a level 3 hatching chick. It's such a gimmick, but it's so damn cool when you get it. Taking care of business. 
It's a 1v5 at this point. Okay. Level 2 hatching chick. It's pretty nice. You know what? Honestly. I think next turn I'm selling the mosquito. And I'm going uh, full food here. This is going to be a bit dangerous, by the way. We're going to run into a melon armor, which will probably uh, ravage our units, our squads. Yeah, the double melon's pretty brutal. We're going to lose this one. I think we can safely sell you, purchase you, purchase you, purchase you, purchase you. We're getting 4-4 four, four on this Llama. I can't believe we haven't seen another one, to be honest. Thankfully, no Melons here. I should just sweep this. This is a very basic team with no real chutzpah. Damn, you're lost it, too. Okay, finally some units. feel like I'm taking crazy pills over here. Uh, probably no sense in going llama. Don't know how we're going to squeeze a goat or a lobster into this, but... God willing, we make it happen. This should be a pretty free win here. We have garlic still, so that makes our team much better than theirs. And we are basically a health-oriented team. So we, we actually don't even lose. We, we perfect them. Okay. Right. So first things first, by you, by you, combine you, freeze you, by you, sell you, all for you. Roll me. Yes, roll me. Okay. So far, so decent, I think. You know, there's a chance this squad makes it, but any melon and we're just GG. That also is pretty bad for us. We might lose right off that. Uh, we are going to lose, unfortunately, to a simple 1 HP difference. Unlucky. Unlucky. That was literally 1 HP diff. Uh, but Llama builds viable. I kind of enjoy them more than I would have originally thought. Awkward, suspicious baguettes. Can never trust them, the French. Uh, dare I say we win this one? And by win this one, I mean draw this one. Hmm. Mosquito. And bird. I do have a bit of a Skeeto session, Skeeto obsession. I do understand that. Oh, a good a start as any. Great snipes. Better than their team. Should be a clean win, thanks to the honeypot. Great. All right, we're going to do this. I'm going to actually get you involved, because you're pretty powerful. going to get you involved. And get you involved. I, I just think Rat starting out like 4-5 is good. It's worthwhile keeping him around. Ooh, they also have a turtle. Similar squads here, actually. Unfortunate how that's going to work out. I think we still win this one thanks to, of course, the honeypot. Gotta be rocking the honeypot. I'll hold on to the pill. Don't collectively lose your shit all at once, please. All right. 6-7 rat. I got to keep in mind if he's level 2, he just kills the bird. So that's a problem. Uh-huh. Okay, we're going to kill the peacock. Kill that. We're going to win this. This one's a freebie. Swans are so bad, dude. Wouldn't matter even if they were 3-3, three, three, but still so bad. Okay, unfreeze you. Meet you. 
fish you. Definitely. This is the earliest we're ever going to get a lobster, so let's just get the lobster involved. Love that for me. Just not enough HP. Bit of a bummer. I'm a little worried we're not going to win this one, and I think the answer is yes, we're not going to. By a single HP. Garlic armor proved to be uh, quite a tough beat there. What the hell am I doing? Genuinely, why am I trying to get a level 3 rat? Who is going to be profiting from this? These are the questions that I'm asking in my head. That I don't think I have the answers for. The lobster honestly let me live that. That was insane. Honey wins the day again. We are at 4 wins. Pretty decent, actually. Okay, let's unfreeze you. Let's buy you. Unfreeze the pill. Uh, I feel a little bit fucked because I don't have a great pivot plan on a on a very not scaling team. We're still going to win it, thankfully. We're going to do exactly enough damage right here, and we lost our honeypot, but it doesn't matter. Uh, we, have, we have a lot of wins, and we have a lot of promise. So let's do this. Hmm. I think you go. Oh, that was a great cow. All right, this is uh, decent, actually. We already got up to snuff here, and we have consistent boost from this guy. And the melon makes us pretty strong here. We're going to kill this guy and kill the next guy. We are going to still lose it, unfortunately. If I had meat on my, my sweet old um, bird, we would have been fine. Man, I kind of want to go chick here. And by chick, I mean... uh This guy. I think that's our best maneuver for now. But we're kind of cooking with some gas. If we can win this, oh, thank God we ran into like the worst team I could imagine. If we win this game here, like I, th I think our team gets exponentially stronger. It's probably best to go level two chicken. Right? Hmm. We'll just keep the cow in for now. This is like decent, you know? That cow is pretty strong. If I get another turtle, that'd be huge. Uh, unfortunately, we're going to lose our mel. Oh, no, we're not going to lose our... Wait, we what? That was... Okay, that was weird. I don't know why that happened the way it did. Someone will explain it to me. Probably due to attack damage and all that. 
We're still winning. We're at seven wins. Hmm. Okay. I think we still want to go with this. So far, like, we're looking good. The Jaguar's gonna spawn at 21 attack. That's pretty decent. I really need another turtle to show up in the shop. That'd be pretty nice. We're gonna win this one. I believe. I didn't do the math. Yeah, we win this one. Clean, clean W8 wins. Some more lobsters would be nice, to be honest. That was f fine. Okay, this is this is interesting. I'm a little nervous. Namely because we are pretty deep into this. And I and I need a level Okay, we're going to lose. It's fine. I wonder if we pivot off chicken now. I think we do. I'm a little nervous here. I, I kind of want to draw, to be honest. But we'll see. That was insane. Our team is literally your team, but from the future. Holy shit, I'm pogging. I just need a uh, chocolate and a lobster on this roll. Or the next. Chocolate or lobster in two rolls. Please, 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 God, please, God, please, God. Oh, fuck. I could maybe win if I get it in one more roll and I sell my T-Rex. Please. Please, man, please. I think my best chance of drawing is something like this. Strongest unit in the back. Level 3 lobster wins right there, though. What a bummer, guys. I think we lose this one straight up. Yeah, what a bummer, man. Mm-hmm. <sighs> Great squad. Great squad. I don't want to be too depressed and sad. I, I feel like sometimes I get a little too sad in these squads. Uh, it's just a bummer sometimes, you know, it is what it is. You're just hoping to, to win, and, and sometimes it does not go your way. Uh, and that's all right. That's all right. Happens. We'll move on. Move on with a smile. Uh, and if the game ever fucks me like that again, <laughs> I'll find them. Mm, let me do something like this, maybe. If 
we had the lobster and we kept our, our squad. I didn't do the math, but I felt like gut check, we win that. I don't know if I'm totally off base. I could be. Straight up gut check, I think we win that one. If I had found the lobster in those in those two rolls. Um I felt some real potential. Because we had a great squad, and I think the chicken pivot was pretty goaded. Unfortunate how that worked out. We are going to still win it. Got a, maybe a couple more games in me. Not too many. Not really worth... Hmm. I might save bat. No. Yes. Uh, probably won't actually use the bat. I'll probably put fish to front. Sell off the, the, the blue ladybugs. Strong, powerful team, bro. Wow. Shrimp scampi strat actually worked for once. That was probably dog and shrimp scampi. I've never seen a build so terrible but effective. Okay, let's sell you, sell you, purchase you, purchase you, buy you, we'll do it like that for now, a lot of ways I could have gone with that, I don't even know if this is the best one, uh, unfortunate how that's going to wrap up. I think we still, dare I say, win this. And by win this, I mean lose this. Honeybee! Hopefully, I don't need to use that. I should have saved the garlic, by the way. That was just a huge error. I don't know why I've been on such a hatching chick train. I am the most profound hatching chick hater. We are going to lose this one again. <laughs> Damn. Honey is a savage. Skunk's terrible. I don't know why I try to make skunk happen. I, 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 I Wait, hold up. Let me take that back. Skunk is amazing. At this stage, Skunk is terrible. Leave so, so much on the table. You're basically removing 2 HP. At the end of the game, amazing. Amazing. We're going to win this one, thankfully. Not out of it yet, baby. Wait. Okay, yeah, we win. Whew, got me sweating. I can't really explain the logic behind the moves that I'm making, but I just know that I don't want the fish to get buffed. And that's that's about as as complicated as a, of a thought process as I get into. Dare I say we lose this one? Dare I say go one more? Last game. Last game. Last game after our, our oopsie whoopsie lobster run. I needed I needed a buffer run, okay? I was I was still a little bit down on myself. I don't know why I put the fish in the back always. I think it's because I always think it has honey because I usually have honey, but it just it doesn't. It just don't. Hit the bird. There you go, King. Probably the best hits that you could have laid down, to be honest. Nah. Well, now I kind of want to. All right, decent purchases. Still putting the fish in the back for no reason I can particularly describe. Thank God they didn't hit my boy. That was amazing snipage. We're going to win this one. Boom, boom, boom. All right. Good start. A good a start as any. I 
I did that specifically hoping the swan would get a little juice. And I got boons. Throw a little meat on that swan. Lord knows she could use it. Don't mind if I lose this. Be super pogchamp if I win it. Really wish you hit that guy. Not going to cap. Uh, we will probably lose that because you, you didn't hit that guy. And the swan is weak. Old swan. Cringe. Here's to hoping I win this with double bat technique. Don't want a level 3 Mosquito. Mosquito's on its way out already. 4-5. You don't need to nurture that. That was the worst fucking snipe I've ever seen in my life. Dead ass. That snipe literally lost me the game. I would have killed a peacock otherwise. Yeah, I'm selling you on principle. My mind was telling me hatching chick, but I think I think I'm okay avoiding hatching chick for no, for once, for mon once in my damn. Oh shit! You hit me with that sweet sweet, but I still dodge it. Oh, we're, we lose this one. Damn, we're just getting thrashed right now. Level two peacock already. Uh, you know what? I'm not feeling great about this run to keep it a buck. We do have decent units, you know, but the, I mean, that RNG wasn't great for me. I won't lie. Do we lose this? No. Okay, we don't. Whew. Thought Big Dog was about to make a mess of me. You can fly like an eagle. Carry me. Fly like an eagle, let my spirits carry me. I want to fly. I'm thinking about an amoeba build because it's the only way that I would ever come back from down. Damn. Oh, beautiful. Beautiful snipes. Another W under the books. Okay, let's do this. Let's do this. Let's bust you out. <laughs> Sell you. Eagle up. Throw a little meat on the eagle. Or the, the Bacta. So now what's going to happen. Is we get a little juice. Juice. Uh oh. And then we also get a summon in the back. Which is huge for this type of build. Because what summons, what's, what comes out, is, uh, is always pretty good. We have an opportunity here for a goat. I'm baffled that I am making this team uh, in trying to make it a thing. I'm baffled at myself, I guess. We lose this one, by the way. If I lose this one, I mean draw this one. All of a sudden, I'm actually a believer.
dead ass. If I could get a level 3 octopus, this team would be goaded. But that's just like wishing. I'm literally just wishing. I mean, it's working. It's working for now, for now, for now. Okay, that was a bit of hopefulness. I, I really need to find eagles, octopuses, and turtles, and those are the only things that could ever make this build worthwhile. I think we're fucked right here. GG's, no rees. Oh, look at that, though. That actually was a lot better. We still lose, though. Yeah, wildly. And they had a level 2 eagle. Okay, okay, but I, I like the heart behind that team. We have time for literally one more, then I have to go. I have to go. Our heartbreak lobster can't be our only W today. I refuse to go multiple um, bumbling bones, multiple green ladybugs. I think they're terrible. I think they're terrible, and usually you try to get too custom for something that doesn't work. Shout outs to the honeypot usage. I wish I had a honeypot. Unfortunately, I was stuck with a, with a good old fashioned not having a honeypot. Probably should have brought this guy out first on hindsight. Certainly, the order of operations left something to be desired. I'd rather make you a 2-5 rather than have a 4-4. Four, 2-5 four. is just slightly more palatable. Good work, honestly, in the front end. We're going to take care of you. Take care of you. And what do you know? The 2-5 the, the won me that. And by won me that, I mean drew me that. But still pretty cool. Okay, let's do... This... This. What the hell am I doing? Fly like an eagle. Fuck him up. Nice job. There's a W. Love that for me. Turtle. God, I love that turtley son of a bitch. I love him. I love him. I'll never peel that motherfucker. To the day I fucking die. Me and Turtle. All right, so far, so good. I don't mind just straight up juicing my boy. Bunny makes a lot of sense with his ladybug. I wouldn't mind selling the green ladybug because what the hell is he doing? Oh, that felt great. 811's phenomenal. It's literally better than a, a hatching chick, although it is a level 2 hatching chick, which is kind of weird. Still going to win this one quite handsomely. Thank you very much. 7-5, 1 death, 3 wins. Great spot to be in. Sell you. Buy you. For the f boys. For you. For you. There's a reality where I considered not buffing the bird that round and buffing the turtle so that even though I would get more attack, it'd be like smarter in that sense. Next turn, I would I would at least receive uh, a level five because I unlock level four. So that's something I thought about and I honestly think I made a mistake, but not a big enough one. Does this work? It does.
Don't really love lobster in this build. I really want a goat, mostly. Kind of a goat. I, I believe in the goat, I guess, is where I'm at. And I do not believe in any way, shape, form, or fashion believe in the, lo the lobster. I think the lobster is a stain and makes life difficult. And I regret the order of operations here. Sometimes you get snubbed by a man of the honeypot, GG to you. At this point, I should do this. Okay, let's stop. Let's stop kidding. That would be a pretty good purchase. I would need a four, though. It also doesn't work well with a goat. But I think this is a purchase I'm interested in. So the attack goes later because, I don't know, I don't get it. Wow, double melon team. That was, was that two stacked turtles separate? That was crazy. Okay, so I think we sell you. Purchase you. Purchase you. Purchase you. Wish I had purchased the goat. I think it's a next turn thing. I think I keep the buffalo though. I'm going to pill the turtle this turn if I have the opportunity. I think turtle's on its way out. Goodbye, my lover. Okay, let me sell you. Purchase you. Purchase you. I mean, I'm not going to lie. It makes it really hard to pill a man if you don't have a pill to use. I guess I hope we win this, and that's about it. That's about all I can say. Decent enough start. Perfect health there. This seems kind of weak, I think, for the pool size. Okay. Pill you now. Purchase you. Goodbye. Juice up the buffalo, probably. Roll me. I think purchase you. Purchase you. I'm actually going to throw honey on you. In what I will call a prayer. Okay, that was like the rinkiest, dinkiest shot I've ever seen in my life. That was like, like, pink, like you, like you, like a spit, like a spit gun. Tough decision here. I think for the whole game, this is the play. I don't really think I have the opportunity to spend money on steak if I want to win with a level 3 goat. Great start. Fucking phenomenal. Fuck. Fuck. <sighs> wow. Tough team to deal with, genuinely. But we do lose that one, and that will be the end of the road for us. Fun little team we got ourselves into. Uh, the Lobster, I think we could have won with, but not with level three. Next time we'll get it, though, for sure. Thanks for watching, boys. See you later. Bye.